Good morning, welcome to the First Presbyterian Church, and I should say Merry Christmas. To see you out this morning. Uh, let me make a couple of announcements as we get started. Uh, obviously, we're starting at 11 o'clock this morning, and we will do the same next Sunday as well, uh, New Year's Day. So uh, please come at 11 o'clock rather than 9:30, and then after that, the following Sunday after that, we will return to our regular schedule services at 9.30, so uh, please keep that in mind. We will not be having our Wednesday Bible study uh, this week in view of the Christmas holidays and uh, family and visitation, that sort of thing, so we will, Lord willing, pick that up in the new year, uh, the uh, first Wednesday or so in the new year. Uh, also that Wednesday morning, uh, we will have our first session meeting here at the church uh, meeting at 10 o'clock in the morning, and uh, so session members be aware of that. Um, we are putting together a new class for those who are considering membership at, at First Presbyterian Church, and we do have uh, a handful of people who are interested in uh, taking part in that. Uh, we want to encourage others also uh, to get involved in that uh, as uh, time goes on. I hope to start that in January. And uh, we'll uh, uh, work out the details of that in a little bit. We had a wonderful night last night. We had over 30 people, I believe, uh, at our Christmas Eve service. We had a great time of fellowship and uh, worship. And uh, so today we are picking up on that. And uh, we'll begin our worship with our call to worship from Psalm 27, verses 1 and 4. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? One thing I ask from the Lord, this only do I seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to gaze on the beauty of the Lord and to seek Him in His temple. Mr. Joseph Wagner will introduce our first hymn. Merry Christmas. <laughs> and our first hymn this morning is number 151. O come all ye faithful, joyful and triumphant, number 151, stand to sing.
God, in coming before you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, and adoring you for all that you have done. We pray that your Spirit would bless our fellowship together, that we would grow in Christ, be strengthened by his love, and equipped to serve you in your world today. We thank you for this day, where we remember our Savior's birth. We pray for your blessing on us. We ask it in Jesus' name. Amen. Grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. Let's remain standing and we'll confess our faith together in the words of the Nicene Creed. We believe in one God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all things visible and invisible, and in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, begotten of His Father before all worlds, God of God, light of God, very God of the very God, begotten, not made, being of one substance with the Father, by whom all things were made, who for us and for our salvation came down from heaven, and was incarnate by the Holy Spirit of the Virgin Mary, and was made man, and was crucified also for us under a conscious fire. He suffered and was buried, the third day he rose again according to the Scriptures, he ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of the Father. And he shall come again in the glory of the church of the living and the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. And we believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord and giver of life, who proceeds from the Father and the Son, who with the Father and the Son together is worshipped and glorified, who spoke by the prophets. And we believe in one holy, Catholic, and apostolic church. We acknowledge one baptism for the remission of sins. And we look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Next 
hymn number 152, O Little Town of Bethlehem. So 152, and we'll stand as